Hey guys, welcome to the channel. I just wanted to give you a quick walk around of our brand new 2021 uh, Jeep Wrangler Unlimited Rubicon. Uh, this does have the 2.0 uh, liter motor in it uh, with the Rubicon package. Uh, we went with the 2.0 one because you can't get a 3.6 on the market today. And we didn't go for the diesel because uh, we just didn't feel like the value was there. Uh, plus it's an unproven motor at this point. It's new and it's got a lot of power to it, but at the same time, it's long-term durability isn't, isn't there. And frankly, we just didn't feel like we needed it. So my son has a 2020 uh, Jeep uh, Unlimited Sport S and uh, we'll do kind of a walkthrough of that. He and I have been doing overlanding for the past few years and we both had big trucks and we decided to uh, downsize to Jeeps as we found that a lot of stuff, especially here on the East Coast, you just can't get to with big trucks. So um, this is a new build for us. Again, this is a, a brand new truck. It's got 250 miles on it. And uh, I'll take you kind of through the truck here in just a second. And then uh, we're gonna spend the next few months kind of getting it ready to do overlanding and um, we'll take you through that process and kind of review things that are, as we go along. So as you can see, uh, we do have the, the Rubicon badging. Uh, we did get uh, the vehicle in black, came with the 33 uh, inch uh, BF Goodrich tires, um, with 410 gears. We did have the four to one uh, transfer case. Um, it comes uh, standard with the rock rails and the, of course, Rubicon fenders, uh, full-size spare, lock and gas cap, LED light package. And it also comes with the tow package, which gives us a bunch of other benefits, uh, like the upgraded alternator. Um, and it, uh, with that also comes with the upgrader switches and a couple other uh, nice items. So we do have a bunch of plans for this. Um, so we're gonna put 35s on it here shortly. Uh, we have a, a plan to put a shelf in the back. Um, we do have the three piece hard top. It's not color matched, um, but we'll be putting a roof rack on that uh, for a rooftop tent. And then we got some little upgrades here and there uh, that will take you along uh, as we put things together. So. We're really happy um, with the 410 gears with this eight-speed transmission. This thing drives like a dream. Uh, you would never know you were driving a four-cylinder, and the turbo is quite peppy when you put your foot into it. So my son's Jeep also has the four-liter turbo in it, and we've been really happy with that, which is kind of another reason why we went uh, with this package as it stands. So.
like to walk around. Um, as uh, we drive it more, I'll have some things that I like about it, some things that I don't like about it. The thing I don't like already um, is the giant key that comes with this thing. It's heavy and it, it just doesn't really go well with anything. So other than that, so far we're super happy. Like I said, it's got 250 miles on it, so we haven't driven it, but so far, and we've got a lot of modifications planned for it. Um, some are pretty simple, some are fairly inexpensive. Uh, some have got some more comprehensive pieces to it, and I hope you guys come along uh, for the ride.